has it correct. It was exactly like any apocalyptic movie I have ever seen. It was just in real life and with my child in the car and my pets. And so every decision I made that morning was questionable. You know, which way do I turn? You know, which direction do I choose to go out of town? It was all very unknown if I was taking us to our death or if I was taking us out of town. I got that phone call at 7.50 a.m. We left my driveway by 9.07 a.m. And at that point, the sky had become, had started to become dark. By 9.30 a.m., it looked like midnight outside. I had to drive through the fire, um, as many, many of us did. It was awful. It was probably the most awful experience I will ever have in my life, let alone losing my child. Um, I, can't, I don't really have any other words except for that. It was traumatizing. We will be traumatized for a long time. It was this unknown. I, you know, I'm like, am I driving us into the fiery inferno or am I actually driving us out of it? And when we did finally reach the clear air and the sunshine again, you know, that my first instinctual thought was that there are thousands of people behind me in their vehicles. 